Hello everyone. Welcome to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So this time I am going to show you. As you can hear there are some uh, background ambient sounds uh, I have integrated into my scene. So this, uh, this uh, sound that you currently hear is something that represent uh, spring and summer and as the environment turns into the autumn season you see you hear something some wind sound something that's represent autumn environment sounds and as it will go to the winter you will hear the winter sounds <coughs> so that's what i am going to show you today how to crossfade sounds uh, between multiple sound effects uh, for the ambience so this is what you hear is the winter sound <clears throat> okay let's get started I'll put this project aside and <clears throat> this is my previous project and here I have already imported some ambience sounds namely autumn summer and winter and I do not have a different sound for the uh, spring at the moment but it will be something in between winter and summer sounds so okay let's get started the first thing is I'm going to create a sound cue like this I'll call this uh, ambient Q and I'll open this so here I'm gonna import all these all other two sounds <coughs> like this I'll put summer here and autumn in the middle and then winter right now I'm gonna add a node called crossfade by parameter so I'll add four nodes here and I'll plug them like this and this and I'll add the loop in here okay so so now I'm going to connect this same summer sound into the fourth input as well so this is our parameter I'll call it season and here we have the values for the five inputs so this uh, these values represent this uh, uh, fade in parameter value start that mean if I put it 0 here this is the value that uh, that will start playing or fading in this summer sound so if I put something like 1.2 here then it will start fading in at at 0 not zero point and when the value as a gradually increase into 0 0.2 it will be completely faded in that means you can fully hear the sound of this summer when the value is 0.2 and similarly if I put uh, here uh, for the fade out season value start as 0.6 that mean when the season the value of season variable is exceeding 0.6 this uh, summer sound is going to start into fade out and if I put this put here to 1 that means when the value of this season variable is 1 this uh, summer sound will be fully faded out and so that's the theory here and for the, for the first input 
I don't need to have any fading in or fading in because it should be there when I start the game so I'm gonna put this one as here start for also zero and the fading in value will end also zero and I'm, I want it to start fading out when the value is at 0.6 and fully faded out when the value is at 0.1 no, not point one, one. And here, the second sound, that means the autumn sound. It should start fading in when the value is at point six and should be fully faded in at the one and should start to go away at 1.6 and fully disabled at two. And similarly this one should start fading in at 1.6 and should be fully faded in at 2 and started going away at 2.6 and fully faded out at 3 and here it should be start fading in at 2.6 and should go uh, should be fully faded at in at 3 and started fading out at 3.6 and fully faded out at 4 so right that's all for this sound cue part and the next thing is I'm going to integrate integrate this into my climate controller here so I'll drag and drop this here like this ambient cube and uh, I'll take a reference like this and I'm going to set float parameter like this and this uh, this float value uh, for this variable name I have to use this one season and for this float parameter I'll create two float variables one is current season value and the other one is target season value I'll take both of them here like this and I love them with the point one let's say well actually I think point one should can be a little too faster so I'll put 0 0.01 and the next thing is this value should not exceed 4 right because uh, if it is above 4 I don't think it would make any sense because we have said there is a uh, blending or fading values in everything is below 4 so therefore I'll take this one out and take the modulus float by 4 and I'll set the current season value like this and I'll feed this value into this variable right and now all I have to do is uh, this should be your uh, auto active you know if in order to start automatically when I start playing again this should be enabled and uh, okay and uh, now all I have to do now is set in this uh, season value as it fits so here this is the start of the autumn 
so I'll set the season season target value to what is the value for the autumn one right so there to one okay and this is delay and and here this is the starting of winter so here I'll set the target season value to what is the value for winter to this one right and here this is the starting of spring so for this one I'll somewhere here I should set this season value target season value to what is the last value this is 2 and 3 okay and so by this time it should be fully blended or faded into this node because this is the 3 and after that I can again set this value to not the target one the current one as well the zero and both of them as zero because if I set this again to zero instead of if I discard this current season value I set only and set only this target season value to zero so when it is three it will be closer to zero like it will be reducing from three 2.9 2.6 and 2 and 1 and uh, will come back to zero but that's not the desired effect I need it to smoothly transition I should I don't need to have a fade in fade out from winter sound to summer sound or spring sound through the fall sound so I need them to be directly come to the winter uh, come to the spring sound so that's what why I am doing this here okay so I think it should be ready let's try it okay we have the birds summer spring sound and yeah we got this uh, autumn sound now with this wind breeze and let's wait until the winter start okay winter started and we got the winter sound I didn't increase the volume of these sounds too much because I intended them as to be ambient sounds which should not be a distraction to the player okay now again we got this uh, bird sounds bird chirping and everything so yeah that's the complete cycle
and that's all for today and see you in the next video goodbye